on the bottom of the atomizer you align it with that part of the fragrance and then you press and then the fragrance is going inside of it hey guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel good to see you and good to see you again do not forget to subscribe share like and comment okay so today's video in today's video i'm going to be showing you 11 things that i think a lady should have in her bag so this is the bag that i'm going to be making use of it's a very small bag i feel like not everyone actually likes to carry large bags to like dates or lunch or just anywhere actually so you want to carry a small bag and you still want to have everything inside of it so i'll be showing you the 11 items that are in this bag that i think every lady should have in their own bag okay so yeah <laughs> this is what the inside of it looks like it's carefully arranged so that you can easily pick out any item you need without disarranging the entire thing so the first item and i think the most important that every lady should have in their bag is their phone guys i cannot overemphasize the importance of actually having your phone with you and then i have this phone this is like i feel like this is a large phone and you're going, not going to say oh my phone is so big it can't fit in my bag this phone fit in this little bag so yes your phone very important the most important actually this your phone the second thing to have in your bag is a wallet your wallet i usually like a trifold wallet because you know like you can fold it and make it smaller um, um yeah so you have this long thing and then you can easily fold it and make it smaller and this can fit in basically any bag any purse and that's why i always get like a trifold wallet um inside your wallet you want to have your cards your atm cards your um your atm cards your driver's license any cards that's useful any card that is useful you can easily put them here in case you want to make any purchases you can also have cash in this section right here you can have your cash here so you can fit all of that your cards your cash you can have you can arrange your cards here so they're not just scattered in your bag this also helps with organization i think i feel like having your wallet is very important the third thing i would say to have in your bag are airpods they're very small you can easily just throw sometimes them sometimes you could be driving and you want to make a phone call and you need this because you don't want everyone in the car listening in on your conversation on and you don't want to put the phone to your ear like you really don't want to do and that. you know some of your friends that they're always sending you bad bad things and you know you cannot trust that person to play their videos out loud this is it <laughs> have the old one because it works perfectly fine <laughs> still works perfectly fine i've had it for a very long time now so yeah your airpods whatever one you have as long as you could connect it to your phone and you can listen to it perfect the yeah. fourth thing i always carry along with me is lip gloss as a material girl your lips cannot be dry so you always need to have lip gloss um, you could have lip balm instead those are even smaller so yes lip gloss or lip balm anyone but this makes my lips shiny mm. <laughs> that's why i always take them along with the fifth me. thing i always carry along with me is a mirror everybody needs a mirror i like this very small one it's so portable and compact you could um throw this in easily in your bag a mirror very important so crucial and you need a mirror to apply your lip gloss i need i need this mirror has two parts one side uh makes your face look larger and one side side is just like a normal size so because of the fact that the mirror is small it needs to make your face look larger so you see things um, very well you see things properly i love this mirror i love how compact it is you close it and you throw it in easy the easy. fifth thing you need to have in your bag is your powder guys your face cannot be oily like at any single point and one thing i also take along with me with my powder is my powder puff and sometimes you don't even need the powder you just use the puff to um stop your face from getting so oily so that's very crucial to me dab 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 and you can just you know take out your powder take dab it in the powder and and your face is looking smooth again like a baby's face 
yeah <laughs> mirror powder powder puff sometimes come in one like compact together if you have those three in one day you don't need to take the uh, you don't need to take them separately but i don't so a mirror powder and powder puff i don't take this along with me all the time sometimes when i'm not wearing makeup i don't bother taking this along with me i just take the mirror along with me because that's very important for my lip gloss but sometimes i take this along with me sometimes i don't even take the powder i just take the puff to just um dab my face if the thing you need to have in your bag is gum i actually like this one because it's so small there are ones that are even smaller been out all day and you need your breath smelling fresh this is it i never leave my house without gum or mint very important to freshen your breath all day nice. thing you need to take along with you are your keys your house keys your car keys whatever keys that you have that's the ninth thing and it's very 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 keys. important your car key your house key it's better to just have them in a chain like in a keychain and just have them together that's better but because of the fact that i don't take them out all the time together that's why i separated them so my car key first and sometimes i take my house key along with me the 10th thing you need to have along with you is a fragrance and fragrance bottles are sometimes big so sometimes you're wondering how do you take your bottle along with you atomizers guys atomizers fragrance atomizers so important so um you can either do this or you could take a small um, perfume oil with you in your bag i think it's about the same size but i actually prefer atomizers because this way you can take any perfume you like along with you. i suggest owning a couple of these um it's not very expensive i got this for 2000 naira um you could have different kind of fragrances inside of it um, depending on the one you want to wear out for that day or for that week so if i'm i have one where i have my nighttime scent and then in this I usually put my daytime depending scent. on the time of the day that I'm going out I just throw it in my bag and I'm off you know and I can actually refresh my fragrance all day one fragrance I actually like in this as a daytime scent is the Ralph Lauren 2 I like the Ralph Lauren 2 in this as a daytime scent very easy to refill you just do this and this can last you for a full week a full week and next week we decide to wear another daytime scent or something like that um like i said i love the ralph lauren too it's uh it's a light fruity scent it's um, only two notes are cranberry and tonka bean so it smells like cranberry juice with a lot of sugar and it's very sweet very playful i love to wear this in the daytime i would opt for something stronger in the nighttime but this is like a perfect daytime scent and i really so like to it. Refill it you just have to open the cap of the fragrance and then this you remove it so you're stuck with it like this the fragrance is like this can you see it and then the bottom of the atomizer you align it with that part of the fragrance and then you press and then the fragrance is going inside of it i don't know if you guys can see it till it's full that's how you easily refill your fragrance scent. atomizer. and with this you can easily refresh your scent every single time of the day like you can even do this uh, you could go to the bathroom and do this very easy two seconds and you're smelling good and fresh again or you could do this in the present in wherever you are at you don't need to always go to the bathroom it's so small so it's so discreet so if you're with someone you're comfortable with just do that and you're good so the 11th thing you need to have in your bag is a pepper spray i almost was like i wanted this to be around figures i wanted to remove this but i'm like no this is very crucial there are a lot of things on this list that are not as important as this this is very very important you need to always have a pepper spray along with you apart from looking nice with a uh, clear um clear makeup not looking oily um lip gloss all of that you need to also make sure that you're safe you're keeping safe so if you're going somewhere that you're not so sure about take your pepper spray along with you so if anyone attacks you foo, 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 you know you know <laughs> as a girl you need to defend yourself so i always advise that you carry a pepper spray along with you very crucial you could put this on your keychain also so you have the three together but this is very 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 important carry a pepper spray along with you yes so those are the 11 things that i always carry along with me in my bag they're so important every single thing 
very crucial just keep me smelling good and feeling good and looking good all day okay so yes let me know what you carry in your bag let me know what i'm missing from this list and let me know what you think is not necessary in this list okay i'll see you in my next video till then catch ya bye